guys, it's me, ExoPixel. I haven't been in a video in so long, so I thought it would be nice to just come back on and um, say hi to you guys. I'm going to be discussing some of the best Google Chrome plugins for web designers and web developers, so let's jump right in. Okay, so the first Google Chrome plugin that is a must-have for web designers or developers is called web developers checklist it basically scans the web page that you're currently on to see if you're meeting basic web design standards so this checklist is like pre-made and there's like this color bar it goes from red to green and green being that you know you're a-okay in terms of web design standards and then red being there's some things you might want to work on so um, yeah it's just like a really helpful tool to have if um, you're forgetting something like sometimes you don't always remember to put SEO stuff to see if you're meeting accessibility features that is common in HTML CSS it's really helpful and I give it like two thumbs up to use if you're you know a web developer <laughs> so the second plugin that's super awesome is called Marmoset and instead of taking boring screenshots and 2d you know pictures of your code this plugin turns it 3d 3D, three-dimensional. Like, it's so beautiful. So if you find yourself taking pictures of code, you know, if you blog about coding or you just like to take pictures of your code, I really recommend this plugin because it's so beautiful. It makes your code look, like, gorgeous. Just gorgeous, it's gorgeous. Next up is Colorzilla. And, you know, if you're a web designer, you probably already know about this. Um, it's just, like, I use this plugin so much. It's basically, the browser version of the eyedropper tool in Photoshop so you know sometimes you're scrolling through websites and then you see a color that is just so beautiful and it will work like so well in your web design project so basically you click that little eyedropper and then like hover it over like anywhere on your website and then you know you click the color or the spot that you like and then it'll give you all the values for that color so like the hex color RG it's just like such a helpful tool I use it all the time so if you develop responsive websites it's really important to know um, exact window sizes so that way you can implement media queries that are you know to the size of the device that you're trying to adjust your website to so the plugin called window resize is really good for that because it basically has a list of common preset sizes for different mobile mobile devices and desktop screen sizes and you click it and then your browser like automatically shrinks to the size of whatever pre-selected option you choose so like you can choose a tablet and then your browser would shrink to the size of like the common tablet it's like super helpful basically if you do a lot of mobile design I use it all the time so it's good <laughs> and lastly another great tool that I just use all the time is called page ruler and it's perfect for measuring the exact size of element on any website so you know if you see like the size of a photo and you like the way it looks and you kind of want to see if that fits on your website um, Definitely, that's something you would use it for. You just like drag in and it shows you the exact dimensions. Um, and yeah, it's just like a really helpful tool to use for that. Alright guys, so thanks for watching this video. Um, comment down below and let me know if there's any other plugins that you guys are using um, that I did not mention in this video. Um, I'd love to know what you guys are using for, you know, Google Chrome plugins and in your web design and coding projects. Um, and yeah, so give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. I have so many more videos planned and yeah, you know, we're just getting started. So bye guys, see you in the next video.